Thanks, guys. And last up, we have Dave and Betty to close us down. Well, it is great to see so many faces still in the room. <laughs> this is our second Monday to Wednesday program. Uh, you know, as you know, we, we transitioned from the Sunday uh, to half day Wednesday program two meetings ago. Um, I am thrilled to see uh, how many people have stuck around. I hope that you're going to make it to either the peering track or the DNS track after this. And then we've got a social uh, immediately following those at, uh, at the Court of Two Sisters. So, um, you know, this is an eye chart of sponsors. We especially want to thank our host. Oops. How did that happen? Into that. Oh, do you have your this auto transitions? <laughs> uh, another eye chart, but uh, as I said, especially want to thank our host, our premium sponsors. Uh, did and you know, really, really uh, went all out. Um, our break sponsors and uh, general meeting contributors. Sorry? Oh, sorry. Uh, I'll hand this to you to do your thank yous. Um, I'll, I'll be quick. I'm going to run through some of these slides pretty quick. As Dave indicated, a really special thank you to our host for putting together um, the meeting with us and working with us, uh, certainly to all the uh, volunteers, the board, the program committee, development committee, communications committee, all of the membership sponsors, and certainly all the attendees that are here. Special thank you to my staff that works with me to pull all this together. Staff come from MS, Verilan, and Two Ps. Some of the NANOG 58 statistics that I thought you all might be interested in, in seeing, um, I'll not advance these so quickly because there's a lot of data on there. I will also post this information on our website so that you can refer to it. The uh, interesting point for me is we did reach that 500 mark, um, which is good, but uh, only 475 actually um, came in and got a badge and, and are on site. Some statistics about the countries that are here. When you uh, register, you, uh, we ask you to identify what country you come from. And uh, pretty standard data that we see meeting to meeting. Um, top organizations that have 10 or more uh, folks here at this meeting. And some organization description. Talked with the board a little earlier about changing some of these definitions because they're sort of legacy categories um, and folks can move in and out. But uh, I think if you look at the statistics or the demographics, uh, we're still pretty much in operator form. Not surprising. Um, Special, oh, there's some missing. Uh, special thank you to the upcoming host. The slide was updated, I don't know what happened. But our coming, uh, our NANOG 59, our uh, next coming meeting, is going to be hosted by Phoenix Knapp. We also had on a slide, but not here, is um, we have hosts lined up for 2014 as well, NTTA. Um, is coming on board, Telex is coming on board, and in 2015, we also have Anchor, which is on our webpage, and that's going to be hosted by Netflix. Final slide is NANOG 59. Um, we will be issuing the call for presentations around... About two weeks. Yeah, about two weeks out. Uh, we'll also give you an update on any kind of uh, format or programming change so that you can make your uh, flight re um, reservations and plan accordingly for our meeting in October. Reminder that is, it is elections. So um, we will have the board announcing the election process in July. And in our meeting format in October, we'll actually have board candidates uh, be available to uh, give small presentations, and we'll do elections during the meeting. We'll wrap up on Wednesday afternoon. Any questions for me? Any comments you want to make before we break? Thank you again, everyone. It's great seeing everyone here.
just real quick, uh, you know, as Betty mentioned, we're going to open the call for presentations in about two weeks. We love to see early submissions. It helps us to map out the program. Uh, the later the submission, the harder it is for us to find good slots for great content. And so if you're considering something, please just submit an abstract. You know, you have a decent amount of time between when you submit that abstract and when you submit the deck for it. And so, uh, you know, we ask, the program committee asks for your help in that. Uh, as Betty mentioned, with elections coming up, the program committee is going to need eight new members. And so if you're considering uh, giving back in some way, we would love to uh, have you consider being on the program committee. When the election information is released in July, there'll be uh, instructions on how to uh, nominate or self-nominate for that. Uh, you do need to be a member, and so uh, you, know, you can check out membership information on the website. Um, one just quick programming note in case you look on your agenda and you want to go to the DNS track. Uh, it is going to be directly next to the peering track, which is in the salon rooms across the hall here to the right. Uh, the peering track, I think, is the larger of the two rooms, and then the salon room, I believe, is on the left. Uh, and then starting at about 6.30, uh, we have the social at the Court of Two Sisters, and the information is on your agenda as well as on the website. Everyone, thank you very much.